Hey everyone, it's Brandon from Virtual DJ here with the tip of the day. Now while looping is not a new revolution in the DJ software age, having the ability to customize it is, and it's a feature exclusive to Virtual DJ as we give you the choice of looping either backward or forward. The standard looping procedure is to select an end point or the start of the loop, and then an out point or the end of the loop. As shown here, after selecting the out point, Virtual DJ will instantly jump back to the end point and repeat until you exit the loop. As you can see, Virtual DJ has detected that I've made a four beat loop, which is part of Virtual DJ DJ's auto loop function, and we are currently looping forward. While this is great for looping upcoming parts of a track, what if you wanted to loop back a segment that you just heard? This is why Virtual DJ and the auto loop gives you the option of loop backward or forward. Let's exit our loop by clicking the out button, and engage the auto loop by clicking on the beat count number. Now when you initially engage an auto loop, Virtual DJ will present you with a pop-up screen, informing you that the loop is now engaged, and you can choose between loop back and loop forward modes. Now the default mode is loop back, and you can see Virtual DJ is now looping the previous four beats instead of the upcoming four. Click OK if you want to stay in loopback mode or select loop forward to change, then click OK. Please note that you will need to exit and start another auto loop before Virtual DJ will loop forward. Now the loop wizard window will not reappear for the remainder of this session. However, it will reappear the next time you open Virtual DJ and engage in auto loop. If you wish to prevent the wizard from showing in all future sessions, then click Don't Show Again before clicking the OK button. Don't forget that whatever loop mode you decide on, that you can use the loop half or loop double buttons to alter your loop lengths. Now, if pop-up windows are not your thing, you can additionally change the loop mode directly from a DEX loop control box. Click on the down arrow to expand the loop control box and click on the back button. This will toggle between loop forward modes and loop back modes. As you can see, having the ability to change loop modes gives you extra possibilities for creating buildups and other loop effects, and it's only available with Virtual DJ. That'll do it for this tip of the day. We hope you found it helpful. Till the next one, remember, stay legit. Always get your music from reputable sources.